Hi, thank you for joining me today. We are going to talk about exporting your recipes data as a text file so it can be easily shared or stored or used in other programs. Of course, this tutorial does assume you have already created your recipe and that it is open on screen. So let's first look at the multi-column report. On the reports tab, click multi-column. This is a good overall picture of the nutrient breakdown of your recipe, and you can export all of this data as a tab delimited text file. Let's see how that works. Either go to export as text up here or right click on the report and select export report to file. We'll just do that since I'm here. Navigate to where you want to export it and click save. You should get a message saying that the export was successful. Okay, now I'm going to open this up so you can see what it looks like. Remember, it was exported as a text file, so when you double click on it, it will likely open in Notepad. So you see the text here, and I'm going to show you how to move this into Excel. Select all and press Control C on your keyboard to copy the text. Open a new Excel document and paste it in. You can see here that the columns appear with their headings and corresponding data. You would follow the same steps to do this for any of the reports individually, or Genesis R&D also gives you the option of exporting all of the report data and other information at once. Now let's see how that works. So go back to the recipe ribbon and click recipe sections here for export options. When this window opens, you can choose whatever information you want to be exported. In this example, the recipe info, the list of foods, the nutrients and notes are selected, and I'm also going to select spreadsheet and multi-column. Click save. Again, to show you what that looks like, I'm going to open the text file. And here you have the recipe data plus the spreadsheet and the multi-column data. And you can put this into a Word document or a spreadsheet as well. That concludes this tutorial. Thank you.